Hey guys, the HomePod Mini is not a new product, and even though it remains one of Apple's core audio products, I've never really paid attention to it, until recently when I wanted a smaller speaker on my table that could do the same things as the big HomePods, but easier to stream to than a typical Bluetooth speaker. Like if I'm playing audio on my earbuds, I can't pass over the music by bringing my iPhone close to the home part. Easy. No need to go into settings, that sort of stuff. Plus, it also works for phone calls, which is awesome. The biggest concern I had about the HomePod mini and small speakers like it was its sound. This is a really tiny speaker, and having used tiny speakers before, let's just say that they don't typically excel in bass reproduction. Usually, they sound a lot thinner, or perhaps even distort horribly when playing it loud. We're gonna find out if that is really the case by listening to some binaural recordings. So I recommend wearing headphones to hear all the details. After that, we're also gonna talk about if you should buy the HomePod mini right now. And if you found value in this video and you wanna see more, get subscribed and tap the bell button to stay notified for more videos. Let's listen to these samples now. There's one with female vocals, one with bass, and one with just strings. So, as you've just heard, it sounds impressive for the size. Now, it's not quite able to reproduce bass attack quite well, but depending on the music, you can get a lot of extension and gravity out of the HomePod Mini. You can also get natural sounding strings, clear vocals. Now, if I'm being a bit more fussy, there's not a lot of air from the HomePod Mini, and it sounds a bit boxy. But for casual listening, this is a pretty fun listen. It also plays quite loud. For very light background music, I usually stick to between 30 or 40% volume. But if I want to feel the music more, 70% volume is good enough. It's enough for the bass to really come through. That being said, even if I'm playing at max volume level, which I never do, the quality doesn't change 
that much, only that the bass is less prominent and there's less track separation, so your music is going to sound a bit more messy. In short, this is one of the best sounding tiny speakers I've heard. Now, given the functionality and the performance, I do really want to keep this on my table. But as I said before, the HomePod Minis, not for everyone. There are limitations, such as you do need to be an Apple device user to even use this speaker at all since it only does AirPlay. There's no line-in connection too, so you can't connect this to your PC or any device with an aux output. So even if it's on my table, I can't use it for audio from my Razer laptop. Also, it doesn't have a built-in battery. So anywhere you want to use this, you've got to make sure that there's a power socket nearby. It does have USB-C, but you can't simply power this with your laptop or a power bank. You must use the provided Apple adapter. But if you have a GAN charger lying around that supplies at least 20 watts over USB Type-C, you can use that as well. So those are the limitations and the reasons why the HomePod Mini will always be a niche product. As in there's a very big apple-shaped obstacle you need to pass through first before you can even use this speaker. But if you already have an iPhone, MacBook, iPad, whichever the case may be, and you need a small tabletop speaker, this is a great smart speaker to start with. And if you've got a big multi-story house, you rich, rich people, you can even have one in every room and intercom everyone, you know, just to annoy them. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you want to see if the HomePod Mini is on promo, I've got links to its Amazon page in the description box. Do check it out. For more reviews like this one, get subscribed and tap the bell button to stay notified. Smash like and share to show some love. I'm also on Discord, so if you have Discord, come and join the chat. Link is in the description. Click here to watch my review of the HomePod Gen 2 or watch another video from this channel because you're a legend.